George Washington Carver was named after our smart, hard-working first president, and he more than lived up to those qualities in his own life. George was born as a slave in Missouri in about 1865 and was kidnapped when he was only a week old. While his mother and sister were sold to other slave owners, his former owner, Moses Carver, found George and raised him as his own child. Moses and his wife Susan taught George and his brother how to read and write because black children were not allowed to go to the public school in the town of Diamond Grove. George wanted to go to school, though, so he moved in with a family in Kansas when he was 13. The family lived near a school he could attend. Eventually, George graduated from high school. Despite George earning acceptance at Highland College, the school refused to let a black man attend. Not one to give up, Carver worked for a few years farming and caring for plants in order to earn enough money for college. In 1891, Carver began attending Simpson College in Iowa as their first black student. He went on to develop thousands of ways to use plants, most popularly peanuts. George's perseverance led to incredible success. He died in 1943 and is buried in Tuskegee, Alabama.